guys welcome back to my channel so um, as you can see I have a little bit of a different setup for filming today I put up my mini Christmas tree in my room and um, I just thought it would be a cute little place to film I also have my warm um, holiday pajamas on so I'm like on a roll I'm in the mood for the holidays um, but anyways today's video is definitely a little bit different and it's actually hilarious to me because I can't believe I'm even doing a video like this but um, lately, I've been on this crazy, like, spin-off or, like, it, obsession, I should say, with this random thing that I just recently discovered. Apparently, it's been around for quite some time, and I'm just completely new to it. I was completely oblivious and had no idea these even existed. But they are the mini brands balls. I <laughs> literally... Um, when, so when I saw these little balls, I first was like, my first reaction was, oh my gosh, how cute are those little mini like packages that come out of these balls? And then um, I just kind of like obsessively started scavenging around and hunting for them to see like where I can buy them. Um, so I actually came across them first on Urban Outfitters website um, because I guess they're doing it like on, you know, like as a little holiday stocking stuffer thing. So I'm like, okay, so, you know, adults can buy this thing. I'm not that crazy. Um, and then I actually ended up finding them on Target, Amazon, and all over the place. So I actually bought a, um, a three pack from Amazon and then I got a few from um, Target because they were having a sale on toys. So as stupid and funny as it sounds, I ended up buying um, quite a few of them. And I also bought another kind which is called um, this crazy weird obsession. I thought I would go ahead and unbox um, these little balls and like open them up in front of you guys. So um, <laughs> here it goes, here's the first one. Um, I just really wanted to, you know, like come on here and kind of just see what comes out of these little, um, mystery balls. So this one's the first one. I am literally excited because I've been waiting for this moment. Um, first I was waiting on them in the mail because, you know, like when you order something first off, it's like a waiting game. So why does this have like three different kinds of packaging on here so here's the first one it seems like it opens up in like um this weird you know like type of way so it, like it opens up like this so I will peel open the first corner and <laughs> it is a mini Pez. Oh my gosh. Can you guys see this? A little mini Pez. Um, I literally grew up with a little Pez um, eating it all the time. So that's really cute. And then here's the second one. So basically this is supposed to be like mini versions of like different things, you know? Oh my gosh, this is actually really cute. This is like the little mini Pez, like the actual little candy. That is super freaking, I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these, but it's just super cute and like, in a way, I like, what is that like really relieving and calming to open these up it's just so cute like and the, just the detailing like it actually looks like a real like full-size pack but it's just so look at how tiny this is like it's so so tiny um okay this is getting kind of interesting let's open up the next one these are little real bacon pieces. There's actually nothing in the bottle, but this is the little bottle. Oh my god, it's so cute! I have no idea what I'm gonna do with these. I've completely lost my mind. There's another one. This one actually I think comes with like the whole collector, like a booklet of things you can collect. Oh my god, a little Mentos pure gum thing. Excited that I got a little Mentos. Okay, and the very last one. 
Oh my gosh, this one is a shopping cart. I actually saw this. I'm gonna have to build the little shopping cart, but it's gonna be a mini shopping cart. Oh, so, so cute. It's so cute. Um, I will build that up and I will show you guys. So, I mean, I showed you guys how it is like, you know, kind of in this, like I'm showing you each and every one. Um, now I'm going to start unboxing the items like facing down so you can actually see them up close and personal. Um, and not like me holding each and every little product up. So stay tuned for the rest of the okay so i just really quickly wanted to show you what the packaging looks like up close um sorry you can see like my ring light in there but this is what the packaging looks like there's this one and there's a version two which is season two that one's going to be a golden ball um but anyways this is the next one i already took the packaging off so as you can see like when you do it it has like this little thing that attaches the four and it opens up in this like little quad um it's honestly super freaking cute but anyways let's open the first one um so this one is a little bosco chocolate syrup that is so cute um next you guys, I am going to die. Like, how cute is that? A little shaving cream, the pure silk ones. Like, that is so freaking cute. And then... What is this? I'm not sure. They're giving me a lot of things to build. And I'm not the best with that kind of stuff. Oh, how cute. This is going to be a little cash register. Ah. And you know, like all the stuff that you collect, you can actually buy like a big set of like the actual mini mart and put your stuff on sale or whatever. I don't know how that works, but I would never go that far. I just, you know, this is kind of just like a fun thing. Up another Pez. So I got a repeat. Wah, 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 but you see the details on this it's so cute literally so cute and then i'm hoping this is not another pet okay it's a baby spam how cute all right guys on to my third one so let's pop this open Okay, so first, a little Hormel Chili, super cute. Another Pure Silk, so I've gotten another repeat. Y'all, my third has like come on oh the little warhead sour spray this is so cute because again another thing that i grew up with the little warhead sour sprays love them and i got another shopping cart <laughs> So lots of stuff to build there. And was that everything? Yep, that was everything. Guys, this one is my last one, and then I will show you guys the wacky packages. Um, but I'm like. I better not get any more of those Pez candies or some repeats. You know, I want this one to be right. Okay. This one is a little something. And I'm not sure what that is, but you actually, they have it's some things in there. It's actually like squishy, which is really cute. Little shoy shots. Oh, so cute. 
Okay. Another little version of the chupa chips. I really don't know what those are. I actually have never seen those, but that is really cute. Up, another repeat. The Mentos watermelon gum. And one last one. Another repeat. Oh, well, maybe this one's not because this one is caramel and this one was actually chocolate, but you know, same difference. Cute. Um, so anyways, that was the unboxing. I'm not disappointed, but let's get into the wacky packages. So these ones are actually like kind of like knockoffs, I guess. Um, but anyways, let's find out what's in these. So these come in like these little packages, which are also really fun. Like the packaging was really well thought out and they look really cute. Um, and this one's series one. So let's open this. And by the way, this one's for ages eight plus, And then the other one was for ages three plus, which I feel so... I'm embarrassed guys, but it's okay. Um, so here it is, like you know how there's Morton salt? This one is Moron salt, so I'm not sure how that's okay for eight plus. Like um, if you're gonna be writing Moron on stuff, I think you should be a little older, but I guess the generations have changed. So there's my little Moron salt. <laughs> um, Oh, and then it comes with like little stickers. So this one's spider soup or something like that. Okay, so these are individually wrapped. I've literally have never seen this. I've never have unboxed these or anything. So I really don't know what to expect. So Edgerick. So, like, instead of Ajax, um, A-Jerks. Um, I don't know if I'm really digging the wacky packages. Like, these are low-key kind of, um, dumb. But, I guess. And then there's this that just came out, which is Log Cave In, which, um, usually it's the Log Cabin Syrup. And it would also be nice if it was an easier way to open this. This one's sore burst instead of sar burst. And then it says unexplainably nasty. Cracked bubbly bleedy. Ugh. Okay, like this is pretty disgusting, honestly. Like, um, I would not want an eight-year-old with that. I, I really wouldn't. Um, hit cat and it has like a cat with a gun on there um and what does it say lick your dirty rat problem <laughs> like what the eight-year-olds eight plus um i don't know but okay that's fun and my question is well is there another one it said that it was gonna have two stickers in here from, I think, what I read. No, one mini sticker. Oh, so like two together, I guess. Okay. So that's what came out of there. Okay, so to kind of speed up the process, I re I just like ended up opening all of these from the second um, Wacky Packages. So uh, it came with this Godzuka gum. So like pretty much a knockoff of our old days bazooka gum then i got this kook aid um sticker this what does it say coca cola or something like that and then Cripsahoy wikis and milk drone instead of milk bone so um that's what came out of there guys <laughs> like okay <laughs> Thanks. 
so the last thing I got was this. It is the world's smallest item. So you can get like any of these little mystery items in here. Um, I actually ended up getting this one off of Amazon. Um, so it's supposed to be one mystery item. So this one was actually pretty pricey because you're only getting one item in there. Um, and I think it's like six or seven dollars. So let me go ahead and open this up. So it looks like this. It also comes with a little booklet on here. The um, age, I don't know. But anyways, let's open this up. It actually is a little keychain and it's a little mini um, Polaroid camera. That's actually really, really cute. And we, I actually grew up having one of the OG Polaroid cameras like this. So these are just like real like memories. Um, and like when you press this, I wonder if like, oh, did I break it or something already? Oh, oh, so you press it and they like, that is so freaking cool and super cute. But um, it does say on the booklet that it's not a working camera. Like obviously this doesn't take pictures and stuff, but some of their other things are real and they like do work and they're functional, but this one obviously does not. Um, super cute though, but yeah. Um, here is the mess I made, but I hope you guys like this. It's a super, super random video, but um, these are the little random things that came out of those wacky packages. So if you guys were ever thinking of getting them for whatever reason, um, that's the type of stuff that comes out. So thank you all for watching. Bye. Okay, lastly guys, I just ended up building all the little things that came inside um, the ball. So I like decided to really quickly show you guys this before I end the video. Um, I ended up building these, as I said. Um, so this is a little cash wrap. This is a little mini basket. And this is a little rolling cart. The wheels actually are real and do work. Like you could roll it around. Um, the directions were pretty simple and easy so yeah I mean it took me some time because I'm really impaired when it comes to directions like this but um yeah they're really cute